So this is my sword that I'm going to use today. It's one of my cheap ones. I have a uh, doohickey around it. It's called a, a frog. You can just put that on your belt instead of wearing a, you know, a samurai belt. It just has bell loops and it goes on. Got a lot of bottles saved up. So today I'm using a Makato cheap 1045 steel sword. Uh, I think it was somewhere in the neighborhood of 50 to $80. I don't remember. Not expensive. And you'll see why, because it bends in this video. <laughs> but the, uh, the fittings are nice. It's got real Semigawa, you know, Stingray skin, and uh, Cotton Ito, and the fittings are iron, and the Suba is steel, so that's pretty nice. A nice uh, double ring Musashi Tsuka, Suba. I'm sorry, I always get those Japanese terms mixed up, and uh, yeah, it's these are all decent cuts. And then I make some bad cuts, and I'm going to show you how I fix the sword. I believe this is where the bad cuts begin. I made uh, two or three bad cuts, I think this is it right here. Mm, no, that was a good cut. <laughs> Never mind. This next one should be the bad cut. And the sword bends. So here we go. Yeah, horrible cut. The sword it's super bent. Look at that. Oh man. Some people might throw out their sword at that point, but not me. I'm uh, <laughs> I'm the kind of guy that'll just use the sword till it breaks. So here's how I bend it back. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice today, sorry about that. So you just whack it on the stand where the bend is, use gravity, straightens it right out. Look at that. Beautiful, come on. It's like I'm a swordsmith here. <laughs> Look, Mom. Just kidding. All right, so here's another bad cut. Watch this. Boom. Bent the sword. Look at that. Hey, just fixed it and I bent it right again. Yeah, I don't know if it's because my arms are getting tired or if the sword is getting unsharp from use. But my form is starting to suck and the cuts are getting worse. I think I think I might need to get the sword sharpened again because I've done a lot of cutting with it. Look at that. Nice. Almost perfect. Look at that beauty. Yeah, there you go. That's how it's done. Alright, so yeah. Here's a here's another cut. Working great. Look at that. It's fixed. It's beautiful. So I'm gonna cut some more bottles here. I think this is gonna be a bad cut. Darn it. Nope. Nice clean cut. Look at that. Well, maybe I should shut up since uh, just rambling on. I don't know. Better than silence, I guess, right? I think this is a bad cut. I'm not sure. That was a bad cut. Yeah. Not a straight cut. Sword bent. It even stayed on the stand. So I made this stand in about, uh, I don't know, less than 10 minutes, 2 by 4 and a couple planks, <laughs> some Gorilla Glue, a couple nails, 
Easy peasy. That was a good cut. That was probably my best cut right there. Look at that. Clean. That's about it. So here's the mess. Uh, it took me a couple minutes to clean up. A couple trips to the trash can. A lot of water. I fill the bottles with water to make them heavy so I can cut them in place. And there's all the water. That's about it. Thanks for watching. Um, still have some bottles left. There's the stand. It's still in good shape. No damage. My sword's still pretty straight. It's not perfect.